Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to use the Focus Assist to control different notifications in Windows 10. So if you're looking to have some feature or ability to take control of how Windows will actually interrupt notifications if you're switching between various tasks on your computer, this tutorial will be for you. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into it and start by opening up the Start button. Just off on the Start menu one time. Type in Focus Assist. On the best match, it should come back with Focused Assist Settings. You want to go ahead and left click on that. Please note if you're running an older version of Windows 10, this will not be in your operating system. So you're going to have to make sure you update if you don't actually see it in the Start menu. So we're going to have to give it a second to load up here. So on the right side underneath Focus Assist, choose which notifications you like to see so you can stay focused. So if you want to set different rules in here, you can set alarms only. So hide all notifications except for alarms when you're doing certain activities down here. So you can set it through various parameters. So if you want to just turn on Focus Assist during a specific time of day, maybe when you're playing a game in which Windows recognizes you're playing a game. I notice that Windows is pretty good at recognizing if you're playing a game, some of it will actually be able to recognize it. So we have that turned on here. You will have to turn Focus Assist on through either alarm only or priority only. And you can customize your priority list by left clicking on that. So if you want to go narrow it down, so if you have different incoming calls perhaps, so if you have Skype or something, if you have a linked phone, maybe through Bluetooth connection, as well as showing different reminders so if apps want to pop up and give you reminders about various apps that maybe there's a new notification, you can keep them checkmarked in here as part of your priority list. And again, you can go through the various options there, and that's about it. So just close out of here. And I do hope I was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.